guess what, guys? I get back from vacation and Bill's got a surprise today. What you got, Bill? Baby Euros. Eater Buck and Skeeter's eggs hatch. There's one. They hatched today. He, uh, what do you have? You had to put open the eggs? Yeah. And there's another one. They're fat. They are chunky. And this one. The cupboard would make it out. Mm -hmm. This one right here is kind of just coming out of the egg. And then this one, I'm not sure what's going to happen with that. I don't know. Maybe he's still sleeping. Yeah. That's so. cool. So we might have five babies. Yeah. If this little guy comes out. But these are doing a lot better than the first one. The first one I had to cut out because he was stuck halfway in the egg. He ended up passing away. Aww. But um, but that's how I was like, okay, I need to cut the eggs. And that definitely is why they're still alive. Okay. And I think this one was, this one's been out just maybe less than an hour. He's like, I'm so tired. And then this one's, he's kind of coming around. He is. He's just, he's just so sleepy. Gosh. Look how fat he is. That's so funny. They're so pretty. But like this one seems like it's got a lot of red on it. This one's got some red on it, but it's got like more of the, the striping on the side. Oh yeah. I'm sure they got some of their yolk. Yeah. Um, just because they weren't incubated at the proper temperature, so it's they're probably just absorbing more of that. That they would have, you know, at the right temperature, they would have absorbed that before they had. They were a few degrees cooler. Yeah, so but. I'm actually very surprised that this happened at the temperatures they were. So, and they look, I mean, they look okay. Yeah, they look fine. They're very fat. I can't get over how fat this one is. Yeah. Oh my goodness. There you go. <laughs> well, I hope this little one comes out on Monday. Yeah, and we're just gonna I talked to Haley about it. Probably just gonna get a 10 gallon and put them over there and just put paper, newspaper mm. or paper towel down for the first week, couple weeks. And then when they start eating, we get to sprinkle poop on their yes. greens. And then they'll be ready to, ready to go. All right guys, so it is Monday morning and all five are out, four over there. And the other one, he went and hid under the rock again. <laughs> oh, he's so silly. But uh, yeah, we got these guys are out. This one's really chunky. But uh, yeah, they are doing great. And yeah, we're excited. It was the first, is this the first time we've ever had them hatch at the store, Bill? Yes. Yeah, we've never had Euromastics hatch at the store before. So it's quite exciting. And they're awfully cute. Bill went ahead and powdered all the all the poop we've been collecting. Yeah. <laughs> Here, we'll show you that. <laughs> Here's the Skeeter poo. He uh, went ahead and crushed. And sprinkle a little, little bit of it on their food once a day for a couple weeks. Yeah. Not I I don't think they're gonna start eating yet because they're full of yolk. <laughs> you can see that they're very fat. So we'll wait a little bit before that happens, but. We don't want to disturb them too much. I'm not going to pick them up and everything because we got to let them rest. Here's Mr. Skeeterbuck. Here's Daddy. Skeeterdo didn't want to come out. There's Dad and there's Baby. That's your baby. And they inherited your beautiful coloration on your back too. Yeah, that's your babies. Yeah. What you think? He's like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what to think. He's like, what are those strange little creatures that look like me? 